Hello everybody, I'm Symes, and with me as usual is Robin. Hello there. Dr. Penguin. That is me. It's him. Um, welcome yep. back to Factorio. This is episode 31, I believe. 31. Blimey. Yes, that's a lot. A lot of episodes. Lots Where of... we build the mother of all conveyor belts. Yes, uh, we should probably uh, clarify what we mean by that. We had a bit of a conversation, as we sometimes do, um, after the last, re in a sort of... after last yep. recording. Um, and, we c and based on what we've been seeing with um, logistics stuff, yep. we kind of concluded that the logistics robots were not going to be able to feed the war factory with enough coal to keep it running. You may notice a lot of robots who um, are suddenly delivering me things. They're bringing you <laughs> grenades or whatever, probably. They're, they're bringing oh, they're bringing me... you belts, aren't they? Yeah, fast transport belts. All the belts. <laughs> Let's get some... I'm going to boost my fast transport belt stock as well. So so what we're going to do instead is... Um, let's, let's run run the thing from all the way over here. This is where the coal unloads. All right. So we're, yep. going to, we're going to run a belt, not necessarily by the route we're going to run. We're going to run a belt from here, down, not diagonally probably. Hi, hey, robots. Down, down, down. Down, diddy, do down, down. Go down on, more than that to here, <laughs> where the coal supply for the war factory is. That yep. is the plan. Attach it to this. And we'll attach it to this. Now, what, what we might do... Um, is attach it kind of to the side of this belt or something, so then these can still run as well. Yeah. Um, so like put a splitter here. Sounds crazy to me. Put a splitter here and um, what was I saying? Put yes, put a splitter right right a here, splitter. right here, for example, yep. and then join. The, the long belt that's coming in onto the end of that, and then it'll just all merge together in a fantastic way, or in, a, yep. a, in an acceptable, barely acceptable way. So we're going way. left here, aren't we? So yeah, we're yeah. going to go up here. Um, I think we're probably going to... If you gonna... do the top bit, I'll sort of yeah. bring it back. Uh, what I'll and do we'll is... somewhere in the middle. <laughs> I'll, I'll also just carve the path through these solar panels here, so you can see where it's going to come up. And what I reckon is, if we run along just below the line, um, until it needs to go up, um, but uh, yeah, I will. Uh, I will illustrate that. I'm going to go round some of the solar panels just so we don't lose too many of them. Uh, well, I've, I've only taken out three, so there's a there's, okay. a, there's, there's a there's a there's a path through with three, and that's all I think we're going to need to take out, apart from the ones that we need to take out up here. Yeah, it's a bit of a. I'll leave you that bit at the top because that's a bit more technical. Yeah, that's going to be a bit more of a pain. And if I'm going to destroy anything, it's going to be with grenades. Yeah. Right, so Which you don't you don't tend to like me doing. I, I'd rather you not do them near anything expensive. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's put it that way. Uh, so I'm just I'm actually just going to take out this these two sets of solar panels right here uh, just to, just for just to give us room, really. And what I will also do is get some chests. I want some, no, you did the split already, Groovy. I want some regular steel. I want 50 of them. I want some regular steel chests. Let's just have six of them, I think. I should be getting those brought to me. So, whereabouts are we at? Right, so uh, we want to unload here. Chest so, there. where do you want me to come in around? Oh, I see where you go. So, so we're going left. So, we're going over here and then down, down here to, yep. to here. And then across across these railway lines, and then along this way. That's what I reckon. Okay. Yep. That seems to be the, the least hassle um, version, way of doing it because it goes round most stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So. I've forgotten how these work again. I think they come in from the left. I think that's the way where we do it. So if I turn that one that way, and this one comes north as well, then I can touch the splitter here, join them together. Uh, 
And then that will go across this way. Like that. Yep. Uh, I should have my chests by now, I hope. Yeah, there they are. And then I just want to put more of the inserters in. And then power it. And this bit is done. The unloading bit. here. Let's put that on. Right, well I shall travel along with the coal then. I'm oh, standing on the belt just in front of it. Which will work until I reach the drain, the railway line. You had to put two there. Yep, that's fair enough. It's a flood of coal coming down. So oh. much, so much coal. Um, this, Ooh, and I nearly got run over. <laughs> yeah, this, so this is gonna, um, we're gonna. There's another couple of mines over there on the right as well. We're going to tag onto this to. It's all gonna feed into the same giant into the, machine. Endless, relentless. <laughs> the insatiable war factory. Yep. Now trundling down. Oh, I seem to have left the coal behind somehow. Oh. So that was um, that was quite easy. That was pretty quick, really. Yeah. <laughs> so just just to make sure that all the the flow is working. So we'll wait for the coal to arrive, but we've got this far, so I'm not expecting yeah. to see any problems. Now it's become yep. a massive backlog of coal, which I can now exploit. <laughs> and, uh, here we are. Yeah. Here's where it joins onto the rest of the, uh, the flow. You're going to need to adjust it somehow because this is only going onto one of the coal belts. So you're going to have to yeah. do some adjustments there as well. Like you can... It seems to be flooding both of them. No, you've got this this belt here as well. No. Oh, right, yeah, you mean that one, yeah. Yes, on one of yeah. your belts. Yeah. So you, you either you, you need to like, split it off up here, which is actually pretty easy to do because you can just use this splitter to do that and join it onto this one, or, or not. Really? <laughs> oh, I had another splitter. Well, I yeah, I, but what I mean is, like, you can you can reuse you can make use of this splitter by just putting another belt at the top and then turning yeah. this one down. And yeah, as, it's, so as, it, as it's going onto one side of this belt here anyway, you don't really need to, to use a splitter to join them. No. And then yeah, and then that that will be the way your stuff currently works, um, all sorted really. Basically like that. Uh, that was actually not what I was thinking, but that works no. too. Not quite actually, because it's yeah, it's, it's it, going. Yeah, it's, it's mashing the uh, iron up. Iron up. What I was thinking was like you, you basically only need to do that. Uh, oh, actually, you need another one. Sorry, you do that, and then yeah. and then you can turn this one here down. Ah, yeah. And then just then turn, feed that one onto that it one out like that. Yeah. Oh, looks like another train's arrived. Let's see, there's another load of coal coming. That's going to be a lot of coal. It's all good. Oh, that's good. And then that'll just uh, stack up on that belt nicely as well. Excellent. So that's good. That's a success. Yeah. I'm going to call that a success. Yeah. I'm also going to a success. I'm also going to pick up these uh, these three mining machines that aren't being used anymore. Yeah. Oh, look at that lonely piece of coal there. Oh. <laughs> that's sad. Weird. Anyway, um, so that's that. Well, that's my plan done. <laughs> yeah, it's just you done for the day. Yeah. So yeah, we've got a, like oh jeez, trains. Well, this we go. So now that now every time this coal train pulls in, it'll obviously do all that business, and that's great. And um, we're also we also have a, like a load of other coal knocking about that we can yeah. bring across in the same sort of way, like this one here, where I'm standing. There's a mine. That, yeah, that we, just feed it all into a central system. Well, I, well I'm, I could bring across it across and just use a splitter to join it onto this belt without too much difficulty, and I think that's what I'm going to do. So I've, I've added this mine, the output of this mine as well. The grenades must flow! So, you, so you've got an extra bit of coal flowing through now as well. 
And the last thing I'm um, going to do... No, actually that's why I'm going to leave it. So, so we've got other stuff going on. I want to increase this um, flow of iron plate here as well. So I'm going to put another, another couple of uh, smelteries in. And also, um, coming down here, the problem that we have um, Right, no. We're waiting for an increase in in iron plate here. The, right now this uh, is, is low on iron plate. Oh, when I know why that is, it's because the grenade factory started up again. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. But I, knew, I do also know that once that um, backs up, once if it, if it does, then we'll also have a shortage of copper plate for the circuits. So I'm going to sort that out by... Oh, at least go some way towards sorting that out by smelting more copper as well. So, a bit more copper getting smelted. I reckon we should smelt even more iron as well. Right, so I've got four more iron smelters and two more copper smelters running. And of course, what we're also, basically, you know, got another disconnected um, set of solar panels up here. No, they're not. Because we're also going to need more solar panels. Because, because we do always, forever, <laughs> need more solar panels. Always more solar panels. <laughs> so let's uh, drop some in here. This mining machine is done, so I can pick it up. Put a solar farm in its place. There we go. And then close this as well. Oh, we're getting towards uh, rocket speed five. Yep, that's coming along quite nicely. Um, we have as many grenades as we can eat. Yes, uh, which isn't that many grenades because you know I don't really <laughs> I don't really eat grenades that often. Grenade salad, not your thing. No, that's no. a lot of plate. Well, it's all really backed up because it's not making these aren't making any steel because the chests are full. Yeah. Um, but should we need steel, we've got lots of it. I might actually just uh, disc take off the uh, inventory limits on these chests so that they fill right up. And uh, suddenly, oh look, everything's in use again. <laughs> That coal is backing up nicely. That's good. Yeah, so that's all. Now I've got all these grenades. We'll have a look around and see if any of the aliens are getting a bit close. You could do and that. They're that's encroaching easy. to the south a bit. Uh, shooting speed 5 is done. What's Excellent. next? It's rocket silo. Allows you to Ooh. launch a rocket into space and win the game. Which is great. Bob should be launched. It takes a bit more effort than that. You actually have to make a bunch of things. But uh, yes, win the launch of fish into space, which is yep. winning as far as we're concerned. Yeah. <laughs> I did that. I'm going to go and say hello to some aliens. Fair enough. I'm going to put another couple of uh, smelters down. Just to keep the smelting. smelting! <laughs> Uh, yeah. Smell's gonna smelt. And now there is a shortage of incoming iron ore up here. So the, the iron ore train from up for this from up this way isn't bringing in enough to saturate that um, facility. Hello, aliens. How are you doing? So I'm gonna put some more miners down. Where are my miners. There they are. Right, all those miners are winning. So this um, train will be getting more all picked up. It's probably still not going to be enough, but that's you know, that's how these things go, really, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. 
is. Yeah. So we're going to have to put together another ore train from somewhere else. To feed that. We also need to check the ore levels coming in from down below. Yeah, we really need more iron. What's happening down here? Down here is looking reasonably good. Oh, there's actually a, a non-express bit of belt here which I need to replace. Makes it go even faster than before. Good. Um, how are these chests looking? These chests are full, so the southernmost iron collection area doesn't need any any new mines yet, but the northern one does. So let's see if we can well, find it. It might do, not do, but I'm adding them anyway. <laughs> hmm? I'm adding them anyway. What? Um, southern one. I'm adding more mines to it. I'm uh, just. Oh no! That's, yeah, fair enough. That's. I mean, that's fine. It's not going to cause any harm. It's only going to queue up anyway. Uh, so I need to find another iron deposit that we can exploit for the uh, for the northern one. And it doesn't really matter. Well, we don't have to take them from the north, so we could go for this one over here. Anywhere where there's room. Which is a nice clear space. Um, and there's a couple up north as well. And there's this huge one over on the other side of that big lake you're next to. Hmm, that's probably a bit far, but I'll just go for this one. Because we've got uh, a railway line nicely close by for this one, so... Oh, there's actually... Oops, just ran straight into the middle of this oil thing. There's actually a couple of smaller um, iron ore deposits as well here. Right, where was I? Early in exploding. There's actually one here, which is kind of weird. There's a bit of a weird sea down here. So, oh, um, yeah. There's a kind of a straight. This this is obviously a, a flat sit. Yeah, this is obviously a bit where end of a end of a biome or something. Well, it's uh, obviously a bit where our old save game originally meets um, world generation that uh, from a new version of the game. Whoa! That's obviously what's happened there. That is a tough base. That was the extent that we'd explored. Um, in in our initial version, version, and when and when the world generation stuff changed, we went yeah. further south, and it, uh, so that's quite clearly a border of where a chunk is. Yeah. So it's well, and also it's dark, which is, it always seems to be like I want to go and do stuff when it's dark. <laughs> it's just... Right, I'm going to clear this little patch of iron and put a mine on it because that's no. Oh. You've brought some friends with you, I see. Uh, maybe. I'm just hiding in here. So, I am quite wounded at the moment. <laughs> the new upgraded lasers seem to be doing the job, though, so... Yep. Ah. Uh, let's see. Chop these trees down myself. Chop them? Ridiculous. Yes, because there's a lot of railway lines nearby. And blow them up. Madness. What kind of psychopath would do that? No, yes, exactly. There's be craziness. You don't need to chop trees, there's a better way of doing it. Observe. See this tree here? Mm, I do. Oh, yes. Okay, fair enough. There is also that way. Well, yeah, there's that too. But that is boring. Yes, and it would have it involves no explosions. And it would have cancelled the railway lines I was trying to put down. Right, um, I want to put down another train stop thing, kind of here, in order to mine this area. 
lots of train stops on me. Put it out. Is this going to be a new base here then? Yeah, the new little iron mine thing's going to happen here. So, do you want me to build a wall to the south? That would be cool. Now the mine is mining. Miner's gonna mine. Yep. Uh, right. Locomotive. Oh, I need to name this uh, station as well. Iron Mine 4, apparently. Catchy. Mm. Right. Attempt number three to go in at doing those aliens. Well, I had to run off twice before. I built a road down towards them for easier annihilation and also easier escape yes <laughs> <laughs> basically run in and go ah uh, have a good age run uh, whoa so see the usual sort of greyish Ooh. blue almost cyan type thing Why right any fuel whatsoever no Oh, yes, no, I've got, I've got wood. I've always got wood on, on me. And now schedule. And I'm my full for the loading. Five seconds, full, inventory full. Then to iron or proc two. Starting to get a bit confusing now. Switch it on. That's quite a tough base. It's quite substantial, isn't it? But I'm kind of finished with this train now, so I'm going to come over as well. Are you uh, in need of recuperation or are you good? I'm good, yeah. Alright, we can just, just, we're just sort of storming in then. I'll go left, you go right. Okay. Tactics! Oh, no, there is another base to the right, but... There's quite a lot of them. There is, yeah. They're, I think it's somewhat less now. Uh, yeah, probably. It's thinned them out a bit. Oop, worms there. Transfectorio Express, I just got a uh, cheap spot. Oh, is that the one I don't for. Know what it uh, one for. Delivering so much stuff. I think it's the one for getting a very long train path. That um, is a bit better. Yep, there's a few more Unless worms left over here. Excellent. They are really stacking up around here. Right, that's that done. We cleaned up all the artifacts. Yep. It looks that way. Yeah, look, I've got them in uh, dump, so. Biter following me. Dead now. Okay, good. Excellent. Right, I'll go and deliver those. Yeah, <laughs> it's my killing path. That's Follow this road if you wish to blow up aliens. <laughs> this way to death. Someone's death. I mean, right. So this train, um, I think, is back now. Oh, I think it's uh, left in the delivery. Uh, yeah, I think it must have been because because you got that pathing thing. I'm gonna get on it and um, just ride it to make sure it gets to where it's going and make sure there's no errors in the uh, in the signalling. It's quite a way down. Yeah. It's travelling much further than the other one, which is probably why you got that achievement, but we'll see. The other reason for getting that achievement is if you make a mistake in your signalling, and there is a path, but it requires you to do a U-turn somewhere. <laughs> so you go all the way up to a, a very, very distant train about, go around it, and come back down again. <laughs> yeah. So I'll find out as I'm about to uh, head off. 
it is just possible that it's a really long way for it to go. Yeah, it is actually quite a long way. <laughs> <laughs> Zoom! And it arrives, but yeah. Oh, it's good now, because now that this is... Uh, well, this train is obviously helping, um, and sorting out the other iron mine up there has obviously helped too, because the iron ore's backing up on the belts again. Yeah. How is it looking? Uh, oh, it's then the iron plate is backing up to the circuit factory. Um, yeah. That means it's... there isn't enough copper. <laughs> <We can't know. laughs> the, the copper ore is actually um, not backed up on the belts anymore. What is even happening? It's been so long since we saw that. Now I need to fix the copper ore. Ooh. Aliens are really going at Aliens. some of the top right. Uh, yeah, the thing killed them. Right, well, this mine is basically, basically oh, em empty. Oh, stick some more turrets down over here. I'm going to go up to the to this mine up to the north. Oh, there's an iron train. Actually, we'll put some more turrets here. down oh, around here. Uh, they're not getting that close. Waiting for. Oh dear. There's a, I think there may be a problem. And there's a signalling problem um, in this uh, iron. Thing and I need the to signals. It. Can he take it? And I need to fix it. And uh, the reason, the way I can fix it is by that. Yeah. And also that. It's this one came up on now. Waiting for a coal train to go past. But yep, it's good. Fix that problem. And I've bumped a load more turrets this way. It's, it's good job. Oh, really? Good job. Good job. I happened to be passing this just then. <laughs> Otherwise, that, those trains would have sat there for ages. Oh, and I'm out of mining drills too. So that's an issue. Right. So I added four more miners to that anyway. So I'll come back to the base and get restocked. I think I'm going to go and have a look at where all these aliens are coming from the east. Oh yeah, that might be an idea. And by have a look, I mean go throw grenades on them. Actually blow them up. Yeah. Yep. Alright. Um, I'm waiting for some miners to be brought to me. Oh, here's a load of robots. That's probably what that is. Oh, they're bringing me... Yeah, I've still got a huge number of belts. Even more coal! Well. I don't need 300 belts. Not now. Probably didn't then either. Hmm. Right, but I've got 20 miners again now, so I'll go and do this copper mine again. Put trains everywhere now. Yep. <laughs> that is by far the greatest risk of death for us now. Yeah. Being run over by a train. Yeah. Right. That ought to help a bit. Train. Oh, the, there's a copper deposit off to the east there. Yeah. And another one a bit beyond that as well. So um, next time we want to expand out and get more copper. Wow, it takes forever to kill an alien with a machine gun. Yeah, they're heavily armoured uh, aliens now, the big ones. That's armour-piercing rounds as well. Yeah. If in doubt, nade them. Grenades. Yeah. yeah. So the iron ore's backed up nicely here. Something with this other copper mine. Yeah, this copper mine here is very close to running out as well. So I'll also go and look at copper mine. Th oh, or I could get run over by a train. <laughs> hey, congratulations! <laughs> Good job, Sims. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> oh, I was carrying so much stuff. Oh well. <laughs> You're going to need to build some turbo legs again. I'm going to need to build all of that stuff again. Well, Dolt. <laughs> what do I need for Dolt. power armor? Power armor Mark II. Alien artifacts. Well, we're not short of them. No, that's true. We've got plenty of those. Oh, I'm so slow now. <laughs> Whoa, a train. This is the, oh, I hear they're dangerous. I don't even have an axe anymore. Anything I can give you? Um, or are you just going to demand it all? I'm probably just going to request it all. Uh, oh, I haven't got the iron 
and sticks to make an axe with. Right, so now I've got an axe. I can just pick things up. <laughs> I'm being swarmed by robots. So for this, uh, for the for the power armor mark two, are we building landfill by the way? Uh, somewhere probably yes. I think I may have told it to do that. Uh, so I need speed module threes and efficiency module threes. Seems to be a shortage of uh, things. I think my um, there must be there must be speed modules in the logistic in the um, efficiency modules rather in the logistics net because it's not making. Well, any I thought more. so. Well, I, I'm. There's none in the chest that it puts out, you see, but oh, now it's making some, so that's weird. So, like, so the bottom, yeah, the bottom must have picked some up from somewhere, and yeah, I've got some on there. So that's fine. Just cleared that stuff. Uh, I get some processing units as well. I'll get rid of right, this annoying little bit of earth. Make a there start we go. On this. Better. Yeah, so I'm just gonna, for the moment, going to rebuild my uh, my power armor and other equipment. So what I was gonna say um, is look at look out at copper mine um, three. So I'll check engine units as well. So we can see what's going on, right? So anyway, the the copper seems to be better again. Um, the ore is uh, the ore the ore is uh, flowing quite well. The ore must flow. I'm not, blah, blah, blah. I'm not sure if um, yeah, it looks it's back it's slowly backing up. I think we're about at capacity on ore smelters now as well for these for what these belts can manage. But uh, oh, this is so slow. Where are my electric engine units? Need to make a fusion. Reactor as well. Oh, that also requires alien artifacts. There should be buttloads in the system. Oh yeah, I just need to. I, I had cancelled my request for them as well. I'll make two of these. Thirteen. Well, there's aliens going. Just Sixty of them. I've been filling in the annoying lakes at the moment. Right, so um, where are we at? One fusion generator, one set of legs, at least, so I can go a bit faster. I'm faster than you at last. <laughs> Curse you. Oh, uh, I guess the power just went off. Oh dear. Yeah, it was just, it's because it's dark. When the sun's coming up, solar panels are. There's about a thousand alien artifacts in this chest. Yeah, it's fine. They, they, they did bring them to me. Eventually. That's a storage chest. Yeah. That's why. Um, so that's the other problem, of course. Is There's that... solar panels in here as well. Yep, yeah, that's fine too. And speed module threes. Do you need speed module threes? Uh, no, I've got plenty of speed module threes. Okay. Um, I need to make another fusion reactor, which I'm making right now. Switch this back to engine units to get more speed legs. Make some shield generators that requires advanced circuits. Um, I don't need to make those not. Do I need a pistol? Hell no. Um, right. So this is actually, um, and of course I don't have any uh, mining drills on me because uh, I haven't yet given any yet. But yeah, yeah, we've got the, we've got still got the same problem with power, um, slowing the mines down too. 
And of course I need to make my blueprints again. I just realised why I wasn't actually getting any more stone, because I had in auto trash as well as logistics. So they brought you some and then they immediately took it away again. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Oops. Yeah, well. Oh, there's another. Just nearly got hit by another train. You don't want to do I'm that. Obviously, being far too careless. Yeah. With this, uh, as regards trains. I think a lot of advanced circuits. Yeah. My mission at the moment is to get rid of all the lakes in, in around here. They're annoying. Wow, that's quite a lot of landfill we'll be using. We're not doing too bad. If you look at the top eight at northeast, uh -huh. that's a bit clearer. Um, I just need a lot of stone from somewhere. Have we got a stone mine? Yes, we do. Um, it's the northernmost mine we have. Oh, yeah, right. I'm going to go and raid it. Um, oh, there's this little provider chest here as well. We are making land for the mine. Yeah, I think I've used it all. Yeah, it's yeah, it's it's expensive in stone and it takes a while to make, so Yeah. Right, so I need to probably cancel these, these pump tracks for now. Some some advanced circuits. So I can continue making blueprints and whatnot. Pass. Stone mine. More turbo legs. Wow, there is so much stone in here. I just found out that right-clicking on something to make it makes it in blocks of five. Oh, did I not mention that before? I'm sure. I I no, I, well, that I is, know now. That is absolutely a thing. That is absolutely very useful. It is. So I need... Um, I actually need 500. 500? I think, no, that's not one. Oh, if it's 50, it's, it's actually steel plates. 500 what? No, I thought I needed 500 circuits, but I don't. I need to actually need 50 circuits, which is much less than 500. It is. If rudimentary maths has taught me anything, <laughs> <laughs> is it big numbers are more than small numbers? Uh, yes, exactly. And, and well, well said. <laughs> right, so, so I've got my... I've got All my, those lessons were not in vain. My blueprint back. Right. Some you can rename action. blueprints. I didn't know that. For a very long time, yeah. but this this little um, the thing that looks like a reload is actually a, a symbol for editing the name of the yeah. blueprint. So I can actually call it Solar Farm, and uh, yeah, and, it's, and it says Solar Farm. While I'm placing it. I've used a hell of a lot of stone. I did say. Yep. Um, so well, it's just sitting around doing nothing. I'm not sure what we're using it for. Probably concrete. Concrete, yeah. <laughs> and we're not sure of that. <laughs> that is true. Um, how big are shield generators there? Two by two, aren't they? I think so. Yeah. I'm busy making some... A gajillion of them. Um, well, I'm busy making uh, two advanced ones, so... All right, slowly getting back to to where I want to be with my power armor. I've got three exos. After a small now. disaster, a minor, a minor um, death incident. Um, it's right. only death. It's only death. It's a, a bagatelle, isn't it? Are these just well, the, eventually, this? the train death count is going to go above the alien death count. <laughs> so eventually, yeah. <laughs> These accumulators. Oh, yeah, yeah, the accumulators are empty. I just placed them. That's Ha ha ha! You say? I just got the golem um, survival thing. I got hit by oh, a train. Hit by the train and didn't die. Yeah. <laughs> Good man. How many shield generators did that take? Uh, I don't know. How many do you have? Probably quite a lot. Uh, four. <laughs> yeah. Four Mark Twos. Um, well, I was... feel a lot better about myself. <laughs> uh, it might not have been. That going... would have been embarrassing. <laughs> it might not have been going at full speed along this way, along this bit either. Oh, that one probably what? is. I survived 500 damage. That's what it said, anyway. Yes. Yeah. 
And uh, yeah, and 500 damage from a single source is most commonly from trains. <laughs> <laughs> and it's achievement. Excellent. Yes. That's what it's about. Right, so All about the chiefs. It is. Um, so I'm going to make another exoskeleton, and then once I've done that, I'm going to make um, another energy shield mark two. Oh, lights are going out again. Yeah. Um, well, the new ones I put down didn't have a chance to charge, so. Because there's nothing there, and therefore, use all the available space. Okay. Just, we, need, we do need to be able to get through it, but uh, yeah, that's we're looking to get around. around. Uh, fleets of bots. Awesome. Right, that's all placed. Already? That yep. was quick. Yeah. A bit more. Construction bots are on the case, man. <laughs> we did actually deconstruct a few things. Messing. Yeah, all, all the solar panels you found in the storage chest with the deconstruction. Yeah. But yeah, well, I want to, um, like this bit here. I want to leave free at least for now because rocket silos are quite large, and there'll be some assemblies, that need, the assemblers that need to go along with it to make the things that go into the silo. So we'll leave that bit clear for now. Yeah. Ah, oh, um, so it's not too bad. No, I mean it. It just goes out at the, at the last like small bit of night, basically. Uh, right. So I'm set for another energy shield. Um, next set of legs is engineers and steel silk. So that's I think we're low on engi electric engineers now. With me having to replenish all my uh, exoskeletons. Yeah. Yeah. More coal for the coal machine. I found some random coal in the base and I've just got it filling up a provider chest. Yep, that's cool. I mean, it's not actually that far from this belt over here. You could potentially just run it out to there if you wanted to. That's a good point, yep. Yeah. I'll do that. But yeah, if I only had two shields... Um, Two of the energy, energy shield mark twos. So those are 150 hit points each. So yeah, 300, 300 damage in total is what they can absorb. Yeah. So we only have two. I don't know how much health we have, but clearly it's not 200. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, or either that, or trains do more than 500 damage. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. I, well, should I forgo my sixth um, exoskeleton in exchange for uh, a bit more shield? An extra bit of shielding. Maybe. I don't know. It's a dilemma. It is. Um, other than that, I'm, I'm, I've got some. I've, I've started to get my running speed back now. Even more coal. Oh, yeah, I've got. I've got four extra skeletons <laughs> again. So let's get them. Apart from that, um, these mines up here are all like set up and uh, pumping out stuff now. Yeah. I have nicked quite a lot of stone. Well, the stone but, mine basically wasn't doing anything. If there was stuff in the chests to steal at all, it's indicated that yeah. the stone mine's not doing anything. Like the, the train is sitting at the station, waiting the depot, waiting to unload. So, yeah. So it's fine. Yeah, where's the? Where does the stone mine unload? Um, up top left of the base over here somewhere. If I can find my way through around all these solar panels to where it is. Um, I think you're faster than me again. Yep. Oh, but... Maybe about the same. <laughs> no, I think you're slightly faster. Stone unloads here. So these four chests are all full as well if you want more stone. I do. Oh, let me take it from there. Um, I don't think we need these gates here anymore either. Let's get a completely empty one of these chests. Oh. Um, so I've got uh, the shield. Actually, no, I can fit five shields into the same into into this, along with um, six exoskeletons. I don't know if I did. Well, landfill builds instantly. All right. I thought it took a long time, but obviously I was thinking of something else. Um, I'm helping the system by emptying things. 
A lot of bots just showed up and I think dumped some stuff or took some stuff out of that chest. I'm not sure what just happened. Unless it was you they were doing it with. Don't know. Oh, no, it's, might it's, be giving it's, it's, it's you. They are it's me. giving or taking away from you. So. Yeah. Right. So, yeah, I'm, I'm basically short on engine units for my high speed legs now, so. But anyway, I've, I've more or less recovered from my <laughs> foolish demise. Your splatification. The, on, on the front of one of our death trains. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we should probably just put hazard concrete everywhere. There's a railway line now. Not that it'll stop you us mean, from dying. You mean the, the entire base. Not that it'll stop <laughs> us from being killed foolishly by trains, but... No. <laughs> we still need to an effort. No, the thing is you're running so fast that you just... Yeah, you just like, oh, zoom across the line and the train happens to... Yeah. Smack right into you, but that's why you need safety features like the one I demonstrated by the War Factory and then never built anywhere else. <laughs> anyway, that's probably going to be it for this week. Um, we've got our ridiculous long coal belt so the War Factory can be fed. Feed the War Factory. It's doing nicely. Um, we've got the iron plate business going on here. Let's have a quick look at how the circuit factory is going. Uh, oh, that's yeah. The both the iron plate and the um, copper are uh, well supplied down here, so that's good. Circuit factory will be running at full speed, which is what we want. There's construction bots tearing about doing something. What have you done? Yeah. <laughs> uh, put down some concrete. Oh, of course. I've just finished. Getting rid of another uh, lake. All oh, right, so you're concreting over, literally concreting over the lakes. <laughs> yep. In a grand tradition. Humanity, we're great. Yep. Humanity, it's more concrete. More concrete, fewer lakes. Yep. All right. Uh, so, oh yeah, we've got a space for some more uh, solar panels here then. That was my thought. Yep. It was a good. I was one. probably going to move this, um, this depot to the right so you can fit some more in or place it. Uh, in no, it, it kind of needs to be there because it's linked to all the other ones where it is. Alright, just, just need to mo just move some of these um, Yeah, take the power pylons. Out. Take the pylons out yeah. and put the solar panels in. So, but, yeah. that is it for this week. We've done that long conveyor belt and we've got our supply of ore back up to lots. And that is a good thing. And rocket silo research um, should finish next time as well. And yeah. that'll be good too. So if you want to see a rocket silo, I suppose. Uh, yeah, that's yes. We're going to build a rocket silo next week. So if you want to see that, then please join us then. And when so, we launch a fish into space. Fish into space. Fish in space. 2017, the year of the fish in space. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so join us next time and we'll see you later. So bye. bye.